previously on Ungalicious Ghana Cooks. It was all fun when our four lucky viewers were treated to our Christmas special Ungalicious Feast. I'm still remembering the Ungalicious aromas and flavors. Mmm, it's Ungalicious. Ghana Cooks! It's a new year and Unga is featuring in every dish for all the celebrations across Ghana. Ungalicious Ghana Cooks, the family battle edition, is presenting a series of culinary battles between two teams of families in a spirit of fun and excitement. Each family is made up of two members, a cook and a helping hand, who also doubles as the hype person. This is Ungalicious Ghana Cooks. Don't go away. I want chicken lice soup, hot and spicy. Honey, now the baby wants quantum bread stew. Honey, the baby wants some small beef jollof and the kids. Food is ready! <sighs> oh, red card. <laughs> it's an Onga for every meal. Introducing the new Onga stew tablet and Onga beef tablet. Onga, mama's helping hand. This advert is FDA approved. Welcome back to Onga Licious Ghana Cooks. This is the next stage of the competition. The contestants are in teams of three to face off in the three quarter final session. Business time, come into the kitchen. Happy New Year, business time. Happy New Year from business time family. We are going in there to create another special meal like we do. Like we say, our cooking flair is 101%. Thank you for your support from our friends and family. Keep supporting us. Love from business time. Happy New Year. La gastro. More money, more money. Bon, 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 c'est bon. Happy Merci New Year. How do you say that in French? Merci. Bon année. Bon année. Bon année. Merci. Bon année. Merci. It has been amazing that we are here. So sit and watch as we display our cooking stars. We are going to love our food. And then we have the Sima sisters. Happy New Year, everyone. Nice. Happy New Year. On this new year edition of the Ongalicious Ghana Cooks. Expect twist on our local African dish. We wish you all a happy new year, a prosperous new year. May all your wishes and dreams come true. May you have an Ongalicious year. Happy new year! Happy Shafao. 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 These are my sisters. Yeah. Ongalicious Ghana Cooks! You have seen them and I believe you're already taking sides on who you think should come up tops as they battle to win the first prize of 20,000 Ghana CDs, second prize of 15,000 Ghana CDs, third prize of 10,000 Ghana CDs and fourth prize of 5,000 Ghana CDs and many other fantastic prizes. There's something for everyone. Ungalicious Ghana Cooks is brought to you by Onga, Mama's Helping Hand. Here is an Onga tip. The Unga stew will give you the perfect reddish look in your jollof and stews. The family that knows how to use the Unga stew and the many other variants displayed here in the kitchen will come out with an Ungalicious tea. Our two resident judges with several decades of experience in the culinary business are waiting for that moment. <laughs> Yes, if we're not killed, nothing happened to us, and we've seen a new year, then there's every reason to celebrate. And that's why we've come to Don Galicia Dana Cook's Kitchen to do this celebration. But notwithstanding, we have another celebration that we're adding to the new year. So we're having a double do celebration. And that celebration is going to be a birthday, a birthday of a special person. And so what I expect of the contestants is that they're going to cook for us a double celebration worthy meal. And so I'm expecting creativity and innovation to be at its height because it is a double celebration worthy meal. Happy New Year to you all. Yes, it's lovely to see you all in the new year. Um, we are excited. Um, today being a new year, 
I'm going to expect new things from that's you. It. I'm that's going it. to expect more elevation, more <laughs> skills and techniques. Now our guest charge is one with a special birthday. She's an actress and works at the National Theatre Company. And you know what? Today is her birthday. Yeah, I am today. I've been watching on Galicia's Ghana Cooks on TV. And I always hoped that I'll be amongst the contestants and the judges, whoever is part of it. And here I am. Welcome, 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 welcome madam. Ah, happy birthday, happy birthday, happy birthday to you. This is Ungalicious Ghana Cooks brought to you by Onga. Mama's helping hand. The families are in their corners, ready and set for this culinary battle. Their job is simple, to give the judges that irresistible, lip smacking and taste but tickling on delicious dish that will make them go, mmm, ah. Sounds simple, but never a walk in the park. The judges will explain the rules to the families. Okay. Welcome. Thank you. And now Madame Miss herself is here. You are going to do a meal for her birthday. Okay. One of her favorite meals and a celebration meal, but unfortunately now it has become pervasive. So we don't want the common one. We want an elevated, special, occasion-worthy one. That's right. <laughs> so the word for you is that occasion-worthy meal. And that meal is a common one. It's become a staple in Ghana. And it is jollof and chicken. But this jollof and chicken has to feature kontomire. Mm. Kontomire. I hope you get it. Are you a, sure you've gotten a, a, it? A celebration worthy jollof and chicken featuring kontomire. Kontomire, that's right. Bon, <laughs> See, madame is excited already. Oh, yes, I am. Okay. And you have 40 minutes to cook this meal. Start work. Up and down, sir. I mean, who are you? But I hear from the grapevine that you can speak a lot of languages. I can speak Chi. Uh -huh. I can speak Ewe. Mm -hmm. I can speak Ga. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think that's it. That's it. Small French. Small French? Small Wala. Small. Small Wala. Yeah. You can do that. Yeah, I speak Wala. Oh, I you speak French. Wala? Yeah, yeah. Hey. So start the yeah. conversation. Oh. Hey, that one. <laughs> I went to primary I school finished. there. I went uh, to primary school in Wa. Yeah. <laughs> what you said in Wa? Uh, my father, policeman, you see, so because of oh, transfer, okay. transfer, okay. my primary school took me to about five regions. You know? oh, okay. I started in Wa. And I continued in Takwa. Mm. I continued in just class. So I class six. Too? Oh, me can fancy in Kakran Kakran. Kakran Kakran. Now, I hear that in the yeah. at National Theatre, you can do. You can do acting, you can dance, you can do a, you can do lots of things. Yes. This is Ungalicious Ghana Cooks brought to you by Onga, Mama's Helping Hand, and is a class of winners from the knockout stage. If you like to cook good food that is finger licking and Ungalicious, here's yet another Onga tip. The Onga curry is a unique spice for color and aroma. It can be used for all of your rice dishes. Make sure you visit the Onga Ghana site on Facebook for irresistible recipes to cook and enjoy with your family. The small when we return, don't go away. Kojo! Yes, mommy. Could you please get me the new Onga chicken tablet from Auntie AC? Okay, mommy. The new what? Ah. Onga chicken tablet, Onga. Onga chicken tablet, Onga. Onga chicken tablet. Yes. 
Yes, could you what do you want? Onga chicken tablet, onga, onga chicken tablet, onga. Go, 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 go. Introducing the new Ongo Chicken Tablet, which adds natural chicken taste to not only your chicken dishes, but to all your favorite dishes. Spice up your meals with the new Ongo Chicken Tablet. Ongo, mama's helping hand. This advert is FDA approved. Welcome back. The aromas are to die for, and I believe the dishes will please more than the palate. You've got it in anyway. You've got it now. So you didn't check and you say you don't have it. Aside from that, I tell you, a bit of control me up on a dollar. I want the hot water. Control me up on a dollar. And counting down from five, four, three, two, 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 two and top one. The judges are ready to deliver the verdict. This is on Galicious Ghana Cooks, a family battle edition. Now it is a double celebration worthy meal, we call it. We're going to invite the families to bring their meals and we're going to help you do the tasting. Give us that pleasure to join you in tasting the meals. Okay. And on that note, we invite the families. Business time, bring your meal. It's time for business. I thought business time would put candles for Madame on her food, but this is it's beautiful. Okay, so that is um, the bone chicken thai with, that is panade in curry, jollof rice. We have coral, coral trail. Coral what? Coral, coral trail, coral trail. Okay. Trail. And then, yeah, trail. What is the yellow thing on the plate? Is it palm oil? <laughs> yeah, what is it? Yeah, that is, that is um, carrot oil. Carrot oil. Any taste in it? Mm. Okay, let me serve madame some of the chicken. Mm -hmm. It feels very soft. Mm. I was thinking because of the garlic. So it's going to be it's all going to be exactly dry and hard, but I think it's quite soft. But you it's know what is not working. You, you know what is not working for me. I asked you why did you decide to do the contumery in an album form? Mm -hmm. Why? Okay, actually, I didn't want to, you know, put uh, much oil into my food, so I decided to go it, do it, cook it, and then. Season. In as much as it, it, it's a good idea. I think it's not working because it's struggling with the jollof. No jollof itself has its own unique flavor and aroma. And the contumery, even on its own, is also quite um, strong or, or delicate. Yeah. So they are, they, are, they are challenging each other. When I say challenging each other, when it goes into my mouth, I'm deciding which one I'm enjoying. Mm -hmm. You understand? So it's, they are fighting. Contumery want to win the jollof, jollof want to win the contumery. So it's a good idea, but at the same time, it's a lot of things, okay? So in that case, could he have separated the contumery? Possibly, he could have decided side? to separate it so that the um, person dining will decide to put how to combine it. Right. Now it's standing. You know, you have built flavor in the rice, and the rice flavor mm -hmm. is good. We mm. all think have yes. agreed on that. I was expecting that you find a flavor in that. You know, flavors match and they, they are paired. You find a flavor that will pair exactly what you built in the jello. But it is a little bit abstract. As, just as the color is abstract, the flavor was so far away from the, the rice flavor. Other than that, it was fine. And then the two you did, the two rather is a, it's an elegant thing for a plate. And yet you dropped it down there. Instead of putting it up there, it is a lot of skill to do this. But do it and then you hit it in between the right. Let it stand up and then it gives you the elegance. Other than that, I think it's a beautiful effort. Yeah, I think Thank I you. think your strength is plating. And you, you always make sure you nail it. You so can, you well can, you can okay. take it. Well Thank done. You. Then shall we have la gastro? Monsieur, this one, my French is limited though. <laughs> I was going to ask you, tell Madame Pamphret. Pamphret. Pamphret, yeah. What you have cooked for her? Say, tell her in French. She understands French. So tell her in French. Oh, really? 
Oui, oui. Oui, oui. Dis français, pas problème. Moi, je comprends français. Moi, je à l'Afrique. Un peu, un peu. Un peu, un peu. Yes, c'est moi, un peu, un peu. Moi, je suis un peu, un peu. Ok, s'il vous plaît, madame. Je vous ai présenté Jollof and Great Chicken and Cotton Le Stew. Oh. Exactly, I like the way the francophones mention the contemporary. Oh, the same, the same way. The same way. Yeah. Yeah. So, which of the yeah. other variants did you use in cooking these meals? Okay, I use the three mix, which is the ginger and the garlic onion, mm -hmm. and I use more of the uh, momoni mm -hmm. and. Uh, where did the you put the momoni? The chicken, the rice, or the kotombri? The momoni for the, for kotombri. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And I use more of the uh, the onga stew a little bit to bring mm. the color a little bit up. The name of your food mm -hmm. eh, is yeah. exactly my problem. You understand? Yeah. We didn't say exactly. we want kotombri stew. And this is even and jollof sauce. or palava sauce and jollof. We said jollof, jollof rice, rice with, with a twist or a touch mm. of contumery. But now we are having two separate meals here. So I'm going to ask you which to one? help me decide which one should I judge you on. Okay. Choose one, this or that. As for me, I'm eating you. Tell me. <laughs> Madam, okay, you are the birthday celebrant. Yeah. That's why I'm going gentle on you today. Birthday celebrant, you're taking all the chicken. I'm going gentle on her. There's yeah. okay, some more chicken there. Yeah. Mm? Mm. Let's go. Oui? Maybe I should speak French to understand. Okay. I'm ready for that. Toi? <laughs> <laughs> the toi class, what the thing? I see how you uh -huh. I beg you take your food away. Thank you. The love, contemporary. Come and take it like that's true. No, no, no. I did it. See my sisters, please. That's shall we have your plate? Okay. Well, like I said, see. Sima. Has it Sima? You tried. You tried to Sima it? Eh? Yes. Sima. Charlie, like the coffee level they it know. It was hot. It was hot, eh? Which one was hot? The plate? The kitchen, the, the plate. Kitchen, the kitchen, the plate, the everything. food. What made it challenging? The time. The time. Was, yeah, the time. I didn't really work like with the time. I was kind of, yeah, is it headless chicken kind of approach? Hell kitchen. Headless chicken. Headless chicken. Headless, headless yeah. chicken yeah. running yeah. around. Yeah, you know me. <laughs> I know. You don't right? know which direction you are going. Exactly. It has life but no head. So just running around. <laughs> well, ah. Let's see. Please. I made a kind of kotumri salad with a dash of clementine vinaigrette. Hey. Mm. Let me go there. Claire, mm. Claire what? Clementine. So the chicken is in the clementine, right? The chicken and the kotumri together are in the clementine sauce. Yeah, I think I'm having this. There's some good flavors going mm. on there. Mm. Oh, ah. And what makes your clementine dressing? Pardon? What makes your clementine dressing? I, u I use the clementine juice, some eggs, some oil to make a kind of vinaigrette to elevate the, the taste of the kotumri and the chicken. And what is this? That's pepe. Pepe It didn't go on fire? It did. What's the mm. sweetness I'm getting in it? The pepper. There's some sweetness in, in the pepper. Could be the onga that makes it sweet. Oh, you added a lot of onions. Yeah, onions. Look, if this is what you could do without a head, seriously, I, I'm wondering what you you can do with a with head, a head with on. A head. <laughs> because, because frankly, mm, this salad your makes it. Yes, everything very comes. Good. There's different shades of flavor from one thing after the other. Yeah. Just that your plating didn't go well like probably you would have wanted. But the taste, which hunger flavor uh, fragrance did you use? For the, um, the kotumri salad, I used um, the hunger three mix, hunger chicken, 
a dash of more money, not to overpower everything. The hunger more money. Yeah, because of the control. The work. Whatever you because use in there, they it's, work. It's, it's not overpowering in the salad, but you can feel that there's something subtle in there. Yes, I think this, and then the coolness of the cucumbers and tomato helps a salad. It gives you that salad feel. Yeah, that's beautiful. Yes, not from a professional angle. Please, you are the I diner. think that mm -hmm. I, I'll take the rest and put it on my plate. Please it's do, really please nice. do, it's yours. Please do. Usually I, I, I would do that, but because it's your birthday. Uh, mm. Let's keep the plate. Oh, I can it's eat yes, it from here. Yes. Oh, okay. Mm. Medachen. Well done. Thank you. Only two families will go into the next level where they'll meet winners of the other quarter final sessions to continue into the culinary battle to win the first prize of 20,000 Ghana CDs, second prize of 15,000 Ghana CDs, third prize of 10,000 Ghana CDs, and fourth prize of 5,000 Ghana CDs, and many other fantastic prizes. There's something for everyone. The small, when we return, don't go away. I want chicken lice soup, hot and spicy. Honey, now the baby wants some to rest you. Honey, the baby wants some small beef jollof and the kids. Food is ready! More red card. There is an Onga for every meal. Introducing the new Onga stew tablet and Onga beef tablet. Onga, Mama's helping hand. This advert is FDA approved. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to me. Happy birthday to you. Well, so this episode is quite special because a little earlier in our previous episodes, we announced that that yes. viewer or that special yes. person who will be celebrating his or her birthday in the New Year episode, she sent us a message on our socials. And today we have our lucky a beautiful Agnes who happens to be celebrating her birthday in the New Year episode. And so here's a special Ongalicious cake. Now apart from the cake, she had the opportunity to be our judge today, tasting the food. So we made her special birthday meal with all of the special Onga variants. And that, well, I hope there's no variants in the cake anyway, but there that's a special, be. there could be, yeah. there could be, but that's a special cake from Onga to Agnes. So that's why today's episode is a bit all glitter and glamour with all the, and I'm looking all pretty and all the balloons in there. You know, it looks nearly like Christmas anyway. So happy birthday, Agnes. Thank this you. is a special one from Onga. Thank Chef Joe, E in Kang. <laughs> yeah, I am very doing it. She has to blow her candle. Well, yeah. So uh, if you're ready, we will get the cake and the knife ready, yeah, and then you will make a wish. You, would you want to say for us here, so we are sure that we are safe? <laughs> <laughs> this wish. <laughs> uh, so make a wish, and then yeah, you can blow so, your candle. Well, I celebrate my day with all January balls. Don't forget, we are very special. We are the pet setters. So may the Almighty guard our steps so that the rest from February to December will not go astray. So they will follow suit. Thank you. Happy birthday to all. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. <laughs> I mean Except all that. January balls. Well, yeah, that's true. Yay. I'm jealous. Yeah. I'm a J-bone. Yeah. They're stubborn. You blow the come back. Let's see. I know they'll come Hooray. back. Hey. Hee, 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 hee. Ah, you got one. You got one. Hee, hee, hee. Hooray! Okay. okay. We're cutting our cake in the name, name of, of the God Father, the, Father, the Son, Son, and the Holy, Holy Spirit. Spirit. Amen. Amen. Oh, Ghana Cooks! Okay. Happy birthday to me. Happy birthday to me. 
Happy birthday. Is that your shine? Happy birthday. The quarter final. One family has to go home. With 250 the highest and 178 the lowest, the family to go home is <laughs> will be named Lagastro. Unfortunately, Lagastro has ended oh! their journey. Oh! Happy birthday! This is the um, hamper, is it? hamper number one. Congratulations for coming this far. And then hamper number two. Well done. Eh? Okay, we are now back from the competition. Uh, definitely, we are, we was eliminated from the rest of the people. We are really happy because we have uh, participated in this competition uh, to show what we can do. Not to be in our kitchen all way that we know how to cook, you know. No, face people and then you know if you are a greater person or not. Thank you. Hello everyone, this is Business Time Family. We have yeah. made it to the semi-finals yeah. of the competition. This means that as the competition goes forward, it's getting intense. So we are definitely going to be combining flavors to create magic on the plate. Yeah. As they say, you don't need a silver spoon to eat good. So watch out for Business Time Family. Business Time Family. No joking. No joking. No joking. No joking. No joking. No joking. Hi guys, we made it to the semi-finals. It wasn't easy in there, but thank God we've made it this far. Um, on the next stage, we don't know what to expect, but we are going to try and learn more to do better than what we did in there. So expect better, expect twist, expect fusion, expect better taste. Thank you. Bye. Happy birthday to you again. Thank and, you. And uh, this happy one New Year. is from Onga. We want you to enjoy <laughs> with you and your family. Yes, happy, you. happy, happy New Year to you and everybody watching. Thank you. Happy New Year to all. Thank, Thank you. you. <laughs> Congratulations, Here I am today. I've been watching on Galicious Ghana Cooks on TV, and I always hoped that I'll be amongst the contestants and the judges, whoever is part of it. And here I am. Here. I have enjoyed every bit of it from the start to the end. Oh, it's so amazing. You know, cooking in 40 minutes, and a real meal is cooked, and it is good for my birthday. Oh, I wouldn't trade this moment for any other thing in this world. Onga, I thank you very much. We had double celebration, double fun. And our contestants didn't disappoint us. They gave us, can you imagine a contemporary salad? That was what we got and it was exciting. Contemporary puree. And then there was a palava sauce also there. So you, we, we didn't get missed out on our traditional contemporary too. We had all that. But notwithstanding, it was a quarter final. Somebody had to go. And so, well, but I was so excited about that contemporary salad. If you watched it, go on to the Ungalicious page and get the recipe. You will love trying that. Oui, 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 oui. Oh, la gastro. Cha! La gastro is finally gone. I don't know why. I really enjoyed them. They really had skills. Huh? Their plating was wow, but today they missed the point. They should have just presented to us one meal, but they gave us two. And I enjoyed it though, but that's not what we were expecting, you know, too bad. Um, I think when you're in a competition, you have to learn to listen a bit and then just make sure that even if you, you, you are off balance, try and incorporate your, your meals and your flavors very well. They had no problem with their cooking skills or putting together the techniques that they needed to go through, but they just didn't stick to the criteria. <sighs> Next week, we'll see the second badge of the quarterfinal sessions. It is getting tougher and tougher. Make a date next week. Onga Licious Ghana Cooks is brought to you by Onga. Mama's helping hand. Ilili. <laughs> <laughs>